Welcome to The Journey. Today we're gonna to talk about the importance of female mentorship in the tech industry. So regardless of if you're a female, male, fresh out of grad school, Jumping into the tech industry can be a little intimidating. Yeah, naturally you're gonna experience some doubts, maybe some feelings of inadequacy. You know, it's that imposter syndrome, but who runs the world? Girls! So a mentorship can definitely benefit anyone, but especially when it comes to women, what we've seen is it's helped to boost confidence, enhance skills, and even help with furthering their career goals. Yeah, it's no secret that women are often underrepresented and underpaid in the tech industry. I mean, yes, we've made great strides politically, socially, economically, but there is still a glass ceiling. So it's no secret, and women are starting to catch on to this. When we help each other, we all succeed. Boom. Let's get into the benefits of how mentoring can actually be beneficial for women. Well, first of all, insights into a company's dynamics. So for example, if I were looking for mentorship within GoDaddy, I would want him or her to know a little bit about what I do, like the role that I play in the company, the tasks that I have to do, because then I have some more insider knowledge that could help me improve as a mentee. Yeah, a mentor can provide that invaluable experience and advice really to help you avoid any mistakes that they mm -hmm. may have ran into, or really just that great valuable insight into how to really better succeed at your role. So creating a mentorship within a company one of the things I love about that is actually can help to boost equality at that company. And because there is still an uneven playing field, it's natural that people are gonna feel that lack of confidence, sometimes not even applying for jobs or promotions. So those mentorship programs are a really great way to really put things in perspective. So woman to woman mentoring is the most powerful tool. Reason being, we can relate to some of the similar struggles that we have in the workplace and therefore can be more beneficial. However, I mean, mentorship of all kinds, of any gender, still going to help you to improve that work-life balance. Yeah, having both is great, but there are specific struggles that women may go through that men may not understand or may not see even in the workplace. So it's a great way to really understand each other. They've been through similar struggles mm -hmm. and that makes it a lot easier for you to open up. Yeah, so mentorship, it's a two-way street. And think about it this way, when a woman mentors another woman, it can also help to build confidence to lead the way. Yeah, I know whenever I even mentor someone, I'm not even that experienced, but all of a sudden when I'm helping someone else, it makes me feel more confident and all of a sudden you have this renewed energy. That's so true, I love that. Whenever I've had that opportunity where someone trusted me with my expertise, they came with questions and I was able to guide them in some sort of way, after that conversation, I left feeling pretty good, pretty good about myself and the direction I'm headed. Mentorship in tech specifically fosters more than just technical skills, starting with communication. It's a great way to practice that clear, effective communication, especially when someone's willing to listen. And leadership. As an aspiring leader, if you are interacting with someone at the workplace who's already in a leadership position, a higher up role, that can help you to get that confidence and even the vision to see yourself growing in the workplace. Yeah, whenever you see a leader that looks like you, you can envision yourself in that role a lot more clearly. Mm -hmm. Especially I know at GoDaddy, we have a lot of powerful women in some powerful roles that are leadership roles, senior leadership team. And I know when I sit in on a town hall and I see them crushing it, it gives me that like, I can actually picture myself maybe there one day. And that's pretty powerful. The next benefit is adapting to a new environment. I know when I first started at GoDaddy, it was my first job in tech, and I had no idea what I was doing, and just having those female roles to really help you acclimate to both the culture and your role, it was really important for helping speed up that mm -hmm. process. Yeah, and networking. So that's another great way to help a mentee, give them some suggested groups to join or organizations that could also help them to feel more comfortable, similar to just having a friend, a familiar face at that new job in tech. So for instance, here at GoDaddy, we have GoDaddy Women in Technology. Oh yeah. That's a great employee resource group to really help close that gap and really strive towards the same goals. Yeah, so with GDWIT, they focus on really three areas. One, making an attractive environment for a woman who wants to succeed or join the tech world. In addition to that, GDWIT also facilitates an environment where you can see career advancement possibilities. How can I grow here, making that very clear? And last but not least, a discussion for gender equality. 
So as a woman in tech, how can you make the most out of these mentorship opportunities? So first off, be strategic. Your mentor is not a mind reader, so therefore you wanna be really clear about what is it you wanna learn, where do you wanna succeed, areas that you want to excel as a female in tech. Yeah, people are really busy with their day to days. I mean, you gotta be clear so that they know, cause it's not that they don't wanna help you, maybe they're just really busy and didn't take the time to think that you may need that help. And don't be shy. Don't assume that that mentor is gonna seek you out or come find you. And don't be shy about asking for more challenging tasks and things to tackle to help you grow. The next thing is seek constructive criticism. Mm -hmm. It can seem a little you know, unnerving to ask someone, hey, what am I doing wrong? How can I improve? But that's a huge resource for you. I know specifically whenever you're starting out in like a new role, or even if you've been around for a long time, you may, you wanna seem like a boss. You don't wanna seem like you don't know what you're doing. I know it all. Yeah, but that can be a huge tool to help you improve. So you wanna be intentional and consistent in order for it to make progress. Yeah, and don't just take our word for it. Look at the numbers. Data supports the fact that diverse teams perform and innovate better. Mm -hmm. So we all have to really proactively promote that diversity. Yeah, and an even distribution between men and women, it's not gonna happen overnight. Within our evolving culture, women and allies play a critical role in us getting there. How? Through knowledge, awareness, skill, and action. So let's all start making the changes that we can control to include more women in tech and really set things up for the future generations. All right, that's a wrap. You just learned the importance of female mentorship in the tech industry. Be sure to like this video and hey, comment below with your favorite inspirational woman. Yeah, girl power and subscribe to our channel and don't forget to ring that bell so that you're the first to know whenever we upload more new videos. This is The Journey, we'll see you next time.